a pretty whale, Paw Paw. Look at that. Ain't that cute? Can't put this, uh, now I got the, that's a shredded valve, that's a little dude, he's eating a little, the top of it even comes with a little thing to tighten the valve down. Isn't, isn't that nice? Here's where he took his knife to it. Now you can nearly about see a, a hole right there. It's a halide torch right here. I'll show you how it works. Light that up. Then you take it. When you watch your flame, you try not to breathe none of this air here. Go along. Just like that. When it turns a bright blue, that's when you got a problem. There's your hole. And he pops it every damn place I see where it looks like a leak. That's what we're gonna do. See that green? All right, I got this on from Ace Hardware Store. Epoxy putty. Cut the end off of it. Oh, that's why I got the, the doctor got the rubber gloves on, babe. It's Play-Doh. Hey! You wanna put the Play-Doh? Now. Didn't get none of my sweaty palms on there. I made that mistake in the past. You do not need no water whatsoever, no oil, no glue. I mean, no, uh, you know, no nothing water. This stuff here, they claim you could make an underwater repair with this. But I ain't taking no chances. All right, I just put that down on there. That's where the leak is right there. Everywhere I thought it might have been a potential, I just put some more down. So I just wanted to make it look real ugly where when he opens the door to get him a beer out of there every time he can see where Paw Paw put that ugly putty on there. Now the next thing we got to do is uh, I'm, gonna, I'm not, I'm not going to even try to vacuum it or charge it or anything until... Until... Uh, Until Monday. There you go. Stick that in there like that. Cap her off. Now, put all this junk back in the barn. Close the door, pour up a floor, put everything back in the barn, and then they'll wait until Monday or Tuesday to that, that, make sure that stuff is pretty. Because I'm going to tell you something, you like if here, I'm gonna, I'll give it 10 minutes, or I'll give it an hour, or I'll come back after lunch. No, sir. Uh-uh. 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 That stuff has got to harden up. Or you just, you you're just well, spinning your wheels. If you don't let that stuff cure and harden, that pressure's a mother. All right, this is that mini fridge. This is Monday afternoon at five o'clock. Uh, about an hour ago, I have started vacuuming that out and I seen that it was gonna hold on negative 30. So I went ahead on and added in some Freon. I got it, it was a minute ago, it was up, up, up to around four. As long as it ain't running in negative. But you don't want to exceed five PSI. Oh boy, nice and cold, Paw Paw. Look at that. You can see the frost on it. You can't see the frost, but it's so cold though. You can hear it running through there. Nice and cold. Alright, let's see. Hi, right, Paw Paw. And we're going to 
go. Finish your ashtray up with Vasa. Fill it with Vasa. Stick it in there. And you might as well go ahead and stick that bottle of water in there too. Hey, much more better than you can do than that. We got to why is she running? Cut off all our valves. Cut off our... Cut off our gas. And then we're going to... Get that off quick as we can. Snug it up one more once like that. Put the cap on it. That's it. That's all. Now we come back later on and check the results. See what we got going on in here. That's mine. Ooh, wee, Papa. It looks like there might be ice in there. I guarantee, look at this. 